Hey everybody, I just wanted to make a quick video to discuss what happened at PT. So my first PT was five days immediately after surgery and I did have a lot of apprehension about going in there based on what people had told me the level of pain was going to be and this and that. And honestly, I walked in there um, really gingerly on a pair of crutches. I was supporting my leg, not letting it touch the ground. Um, I had a lot of pain from the brace and the physical therapy or physical therapist asked me why I wasn't bearing any weight on the leg and I candidly told him because it hurt like hell and I felt like I had a little bit of a problem up here um, because I was afraid to put weight down on it because of the pain and so he spent a lot of time with me kind of talking that through um, he did a little bit of range of motion um, analysis or evaluation on the leg flexibility this that and the other he showed me how to do quad sets how to stretch it and different things and then he got me out on the floor put me on an exercise bike and told me to do semicircles like with the pedals just halfway around and back halfway around and back um, that was a five minute stint on that bike and by the end of the five minutes I had made two full revolutions I gotten it stretched out to the point that I could make two full revolutions on the bike. Then he showed me a new way to walk on two crutches and he showed me a way to walk on one crutch and then he had me walk with no crutches. And I'm going to tell you, it was scary at first. Um, I really was afraid I was going to fall down, but he gave me good support psychologically, physically, all the way through. And honestly, by the time it was done, I walked out of the place with my crutches in my hand and I have been getting better on my feet without the crutches ever since. So five days after surgery, I was, I'm going to call it walking. Um, you're just kind of shuffling, hobbling, but you don't really need those crutches. The knee brace was locked at a 90 degree angle. So, or, or pardon me, it was locked straight out. So you can't bend the knee at all, but you can swing the leg and it can bear the weight. And then the knee offers, the, the brace offers the support that you need so that nothing crazy happens. So really, frankly, I don't know what all of the fear mongering is about physical therapy. Maybe people have had bad experiences. Mine was really not that bad. The guy was really supportive. I'm excited to go back and see him. But I couldn't get an appointment back there for 10 days. Um, and then after I go back 10 days later, um, I will then go two times a week after that for the next month. So in the meantime, I've been doing the exercises he gave me, trying to stretch it. Um, I did find a way better way to adjust the brace so it doesn't cause me as much pain. Um, it's a telescopic brace. It's a little hard to explain, and I'm not going to move the camera around and make you guys sick um, with my creature cam. But um, basically, I took the top half, and opened the telescopic side and slid the, the straps way up my thigh. So they're really grabbing like just under my right glute and it gives them a better hold on a thin part of the upper leg so that the thicker part of the middle hamstring and quad fills up a gap and then there's a strap that goes around at the top of the knee, which is the bottom of the femur. And it seems to hold the brace in a lot better position, whereas before there was nothing for it to really grab onto and my, my leg is, muscle is shaped like this and it just wanted to continually slide down that V. It was putting pressure on the patella, hurting the patella tendon, like you just didn't even want to wear it. Every chance I got, I was taking the thing off. Um, now I can wear it, walk around for great lengths. Um, I've got 2,600 steps in on the Fitbit today and the surgery was a week ago Thursday and today is Monday. So seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven days later. Um, so I'm going to put a follow-up video on what's happened since day four post-op up until today. This is what happened at PT. Um, we're starting to see the light at the end of the tunnel here, and I hope this helps. Thanks for watching.